Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended family, just thank you for being you. You know, thank you for opening up to me, you know, showing love and support to me. And you, as you're healing, I'm healing as well. And we're sending, you know, loving vibes towards each other, which is, you know, very beautiful and with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you've been watching my videos for a while i have not already what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know what i'm about to upload my next video and if you're comfortable enough please go ahead and drop me a line i love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction and if you feel like the videos gave you good vibes and understanding where you want to share with a loved one or a friend, please go ahead and do so. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites as well. And once again, thank you so much for stopping by my channel and showing love to the channel. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And today, I am my meditation music that I'm listening to today is uh, Get Good News Fast. Miracle ha mir Miracles Happens while you sleep try try yourself loa meditation music and i will post that link in the description box below and my video today is about twin flame 101 hey okas when purging gets intense it, it gets very intense it's like that's why i haven't did, did no videos for y'all yesterday i said with the weather changing especially with me living in georgia you know there's some i got some extended family that lives in georgia so they didn't know what weather i'm talking about it's been hot it's been cold it's been rainy and then it's got really cold so it's like all my i don't know if my immune system is just trying to get used to it because it's been so warm here lately and it, it's just like I had to take a break <laughs> I had to take another break and I felt so bad it's just like I had to sleep all day and you know I got better lighting in here I decided I'm gonna go ahead and do my um, vlogging in my room now it's just the comfort of my own home so why don't I be comfortable so it's just like and plus it's, it gets brighter in my room anyway so um yeah it's just like with the purging it's been very intense like today I went on um, YouTube and went to ten of cups ministries I've uh, talked about them a while back in my videos they are like uh, twin flame meditations and things that happen with twin flames and stuff and I felt so good because it's just like I don't know about y'all but it's like past memories and past like um, things that hindered me that it really triggered off some stuff and it's just like when I have vibes like that I've told y'all many times if I have vibes where I feel irritable and I can't fake the funk with y'all I can't sit up here and just you know put on a big smile when I'm having all this different emotions in me you know because who would want somebody to you just pull that on them you already going through enough stuff and you know with us being empaths we be able to you know just feel things through videos it, you know feel things just through people's words that they put out so it's just like I had to take a break. I had to go ahead and meditate and, you know, exercise. It was like yesterday I was just like my vibes was very low. I just was not feeling good. Head was hurting, just very irritable. And it's just like I had to take out some me time. You know, I felt bad because, you know, I love doing videos for y'all every day. But there's times I run on fuel. <laughs> you will notice I'm running on fuel. Either my words will drag if I'm not getting downloads, you know, and it sounds like I can't get them out. It sounds like I'm drunk. I'm like, I'm tired. It will make me feel that way. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, this video looks like I'm drunk and I'm not drunk. But it's like when I push out so much love and it's just like, I can keep going. I can keep going. It's like, no, you cannot. <laughs> Sit down. Sit down and just relax. You're doing too much. You really you know you're doing too much so it's just like i don't know you know with y'all if it's like um everything's starting to move a lot faster i don't know what it is it's just like you know dag it just felt like the beginning of the year and now it's almost at the end of the year we only got one more month left but i'm like god dog is you know almost new year's already christmas already but it's just like all the things that you know i've been going through purging trying to let go of things you know dealing with things that 
you know, they can really mess up my blessings and mess up my future. And it's just like, I, you know, I have to tell my higher self, higher self, have conversations with my higher self and say, you know, I really need to let go of these things. No matter what other people are doing around me or, you know, they've done to me, I can't allow that to affect me. I can't allow that to stop me from what I'm doing because I really love what I do. And I know what I'm doing can take me to bigger and better forms in my life that I, you know, I, I've always dreamed of. So it's just like when we go through things and you know right now it is coming at us hard. I don't know if it's because it's, because it's coming towards the end of the year to start something new. But it's just a lot of shifting that I notice a lot of us as empaths are doing right now. And it's like we're, I, I keep on seeing let go, let go, let go, let go, let go. And there are so many things, you know, that you it's like peeling back an onion. You have layers and layers. Like when you feel like you're done, it's like more, it's like you make room for all this love and next thing you know, all these other memories come back. But it's just like after I meditated for like over an hour, I felt so good. I cried. I released. You know, I felt very good. But I knew I had to get that purging out. I knew there was things that I had to set free. If I want to be able to go home, be in that true form self of mine, I know I had to release everything that is holding me back. Any anger that I feel towards my family, any anger that I feel towards my ex, you know, I can't keep holding on to that. You know, I can't keep dealing with that because it's like the more I keep thinking about it and the more I, you know, I stay focused on that, the more, you know, you, it manifests. So it's just like, you know, when you know the, you're tired, <laughs> you know, you're tired. You're like, oh, okay. What do I got to do? I surrender. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> you know, you really have to do it. You have to really force yourself to say, you know what? These things are not happening to me just because they happen to me. Doesn't mean they're keep on happening to me. And if something that you're you're in a situation where it continues to happen, you're going to tell yourself you are going to be set free from this situation. You have to see the light out of that situation. And I keep telling myself that, you know, because it's just like it gets intense to the point where, you know, where the devil wants me to do something dark. The devil wants me to do something hateful. And I have to really check myself like, whoa, you know, pause. <laughs> pause and release just pause and release you know we just really have to let go of like past trauma like a balloon because this is if something that we can truly heal from and I know there are sometimes it's so hard to do because it's like it depends on the magnitude of your situation you know it's not something that you can get over overnight but it's going to take time but I know a lot of times with myself I sit up here and get frustrated like you know when am I going to hurry up and get over this? I want to get over this right now. And then those memory patterns keep making me go through that, that loop, you know? So it's just, I know that that has to be, you know, it needs to be just done, just, just finito. So, you know, when you're going through your stuff, knowing it might be intense right now, but it, it has to probably be intense for this very moment. It's because it needs you as much stuff as we manifest it through our negative thoughts, our feelings, our aggressions, you know, um, things that we still hold on to, uh, like a security blanket that we have went through in life, you know, it will make us keep going through that rotating loop and it will manifest a lot of negativity in our life, especially if we talk about it a lot, because I know I do. You know, and I said, I'm, I'm not going to say I don't because there are times I've sat here and thought about and actually talked about things that I went through. But it's okay to vent to get them out, but it's just the, the point is we can't keep on thinking about the same things over again because it, all it is is hurting ourselves and, you know, and just makes you really upset and you don't want to do that. So I hope you were able to resonate with the content of my video. I hope you had a blessed week and a lovely night and lovely evening day or whatever you had. I'm sending out as much love and light and positivity as I possibly can. And I hope you send out love and light and positivity as you possibly can. And knowing better days are truly coming for us. We just have to keep faith on that. And you know what? Give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. Drop me a line. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. And let me know that if you, you know, like and subscribe and even hit that notification bell so you can let me know you're notified. So I can give you a shout out. And I'm going to give my post notification shout outs real quick. And I'm giving um, a shout out to Robert Cole. Much love to you. And I hope you're having a blessed week and sending love and energy stuff to you that way. And you know what? 
give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites as well know that you are blessed truly favored and highly loved and knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days so i'll see you on my next video peace and be wild Ow!